What is up, comic fam? Happy Monday. Welcome to the Legion of Comics. I'm Mark, and today I'm going to be going over a massive stack of mail. Some of these are exclusive. Some of these are uh, Instagram seller slash Facebook seller, and also made some massive, massive toy finds that I'm super excited to share with everybody. We're going to be going over that and some major channel announcements that are very important that pertain to the upcoming giveaway. But before we get into any of that, check this out. <music> So if you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you haven't already, hit that thumbs up. It helps out the channel a whole lot. So let's get right into it. I want to start off by highlighting a new seller to Instagram who's trying to get started on Facebook as well as on both platforms. But it's actually a guy who I met local here in the Augusta area at the greatest comic shop known to man, the Augusta Book Exchange. And his name is Ro, but on uh, social medias, he goes by Butterball something. So I'm going to put his information in the description of this video. So please go down there, hit that, give him a follow, let him know that we are Legion and show him some community love. Great guy. Uh, so I've managed to find two books. He hit me up, said that he came across a stack of Hulk books and uh, he showed me the ones he had. And uh, there was two of them that I was missing. And that's issue number 177 and 178, which is awesome because these are the Adam Warlock issues. So the sub 100, I know it says 177. If you're new to this, uh, issue one was technically issue 102. So the, this is still within the first 100 issues of the volume. So these are the lower ones. And I'm trying to finish out that first 100 issues and be done with the run. And uh, yeah, that was awesome to catch those. You know, Adam Warlock is going to be in the upcoming Guardians of the Galaxy movie. Uh, I believe that's the one that he's supposed to be in. I'm definitely looking forward to that. And then a couple of these packages uh, I've been sitting on for a little while. This one is dated 7-22-22. That's not right. But this one came, I got, got here a few weeks back before I went on vacation. And um, it's from not my go-to shop this is from frankie's comics i do order uh, from them consistently but only when they have specific book by specific artists and y'all already know who it is y'all know what time it is it's that jang gang baby this is the closet issue number one the john jang variant right there some closet goodness this is james tynan the fourth substack story it was uh, first started on substack and then it moved over to uh the floppy copy edition so I don't know what it's about. Obviously, it's about monsters in the closet. But uh, you got to support my man, Mr. John Jang. Always doing amazing stuff. And, uh, yeah, he just wrapped up at Trificon this past weekend. But, yeah, that's a pretty dope cover. Definitely came out a little bit dark sometimes, especially when you do the digital art to paper. You got to be a little careful with the transfer. But it still came out looking good. A wicked cover. It reminds me of the Alien from Signs. But yeah, that's excited to have that one. Uh, so next up, real quick, I do want to shout out some stuff along the way. So big thank you to Big Time Collectibles for sponsoring the channel and the monthly giveaway for our channel members. Be sure to check out Big Time Collectibles on uh, all the social medias. It depends on where you're at. They're there. Instagram, Facebook, all that good stuff. I don't know if they're if they're uh, on, uh, what's it called? That short one. TikTok. I don't know if they're on TikTok or not, but they're always doing big things. Great exclusives all the time. Mystery boxes that are always like insane value, which that's one of the announcements. Uh, be on the lookout. I know if you've watched them before, you know not to miss them, but we're going to be doing an upcoming mystery box battle again with some familiar faces, including Nick's Kicks and Comics, Sector 2815, Mr. DJ Links, and Squad. So uh, all that is going to be super exciting. You never want to miss those. Holy crap. So this is the one from Over the Pond. This one came from long and far away. This is from 789 Comics. And you heard that right. The number 7, the word A-T-E, and then the number 9. 789 Comics. So I had to uh, I order this one from the United Kingdom. This was a direct edition book when it first came out. And I got multiple copies. I've even given some away along the way. 
because whenever they do direct edition for this guy, I always get him holy balls. But this is actually the Comic Mint comic book marketplace, but it came from across the pond. I think the Comic Mint was out when I went to get it. But this is called Twisted Haunted High Oms, issue number four, The Curse of the Green Book, exclusive variant art by John Jang. This is a Source Point Press book. And I had to go back because I got the standard trade dress, but I had to go back and get that virgin chromed out, foil goodness. Look at that. Even the back has got the image and foiled all the way out of its mind right there, as uh, Wink Inc. would say, out of its mind. But dude, that is that came out. That came out amazing. Like, holy bejeebus. Wow. And again, the horrific covers. If you watch the... Uh, the new comic book day video that i just posted this saturday uh, be sure to go back and check it out if you didn't there are some major horrific covers coming up this week by the man himself mr john jang so also i've got a major package here from none other than randy aka legal burning the uh phenomenal artist i'm excited to get into but i want to show you some of these toy finds uh first off my uh, stepmom was looking out for me while she was out shopping and she came across a black adam page puncher and I said, heck yeah, grab it. I don't have it. And it's the uh, standard one. And uh, so it's got that Boss Logic cover and the three-inch Black Adam figure there, which is dope because I've got uh, I've got numerous ones of these Batman still. I had more, but the kids got into them. They got into one of the Batman ones and the Flash one. So I got to recoup those. Now, I want to get the whole set. There's four of them, and I want to get multiples of that Batman. If you come across that Batman one out there, it's getting kind of spotty trying to find it. And the values for it are all over the place, but McFarland's Toy Store Online still has them. You can buy them as a set at a reduced price and get all four of them if you're interested. Be sure to check out his website. Tons of dope stuff all the time. So uh, switching over, this is a standard McFarland toys, and uh, I didn't really chase these because I felt like they were easy to find, and I'm glad I, that I held off because this is a... Uh, the Riddler from the most recent movie, The Batman. And I've got the standard Batman one. And I wanted to get all four of the primary characters with Batman, Catwoman, The Riddler, and Penguin. And I'm glad I waited because while I was out with the kids today, we kind of, uh, the day that I filmed this, so we were out just kind of toy hunting for them and myself. And I came across this at Target for $5.99. Like that was insane on clearance. So I'm going to take the time to uh, meticulously take off that sticker. The boxes don't mean the world to me. I do like having them in good shape, but I do like to be able to take these out and display them. So, bro, I, again, if you saw the video that I posted last week, I've been crushing it, finding these at killer deals all over the place. But if you if you wait, they'll show up. And now, here's the big one. I actually took to Instagram while I was on vacation and made a post and asked for a little bit of help with this one because I was really concerned with actually finding it in the wild. And it's very important for the set that I'm trying to build with the swamp thing there and the demon and dr fate but i managed to get that seven inch page puncher of john constantine like boom there it is so this one's actually really cool this whole set is really cool now there's four of them in this where you get uh, superman batman and black adam just like in the small page punchers but instead of the flash they do constantine now where the other ones are all just reprints of their own comics this one has a special edition comic for Black Adam with a Lee Bermejo cover made just for this set. Now, you see it's got all four of them there pictured on the cover. It's the same comic that comes with each of them. And they've also started to do black and white versions of the figures. I've seen the Batman one out in public everywhere. And uh, then they announced, I think last week, that they're doing a Black Adam one where the actual comic included in it actually looks different. So this one is fantastic. It comes with a book, a hand, a trading card, a comic. So it comes with everything that is standard. McFarlane figure wood with the trading card, the accessory, the stand and everything. It's sized properly. So this is going into the uh, into the Justice League Dark McFarlane set that I'm trying to build. Now we just need to get him to make his Zatanna and then I'll start begging for a, a dead man from there. And maybe we'll get a mega figure Spectre one day. So until then, I'm probably just going to get out my uh, Spectre uh, statue slash hero clip, the colossal hero clip statue. And just post it up behind the rest of them. And I'm building that Justice League Dark. Also have a huge order from McFarlane, McFarlane Toy Store set to arrive on new comic book day. Holy crap. So uh, I'm opening this giant package from Legal Burning. And it says, enjoy blessings, Legal Burning. Holy crap. 
stop it. A stack of stuff here. So this stuff was donated to the channel by Legal Burning to use as giveaways, promos, just, just whatever. And uh, uh, man, so there's a bunch of these smaller ones, and then there's these full size backer board ones. Holy crap! I think these are the prints. Let's see. Legal Burning Hand Burden Comics Collect. So he has all the stuff on there. So there's the Mighty Thor with Beta Ray Bill, the Darth Vader one. Oh my goodness. Doctor Strange. The giant size X Men, Kylo Ren, Remy Q's favorite, right there, baby. Remy Q, there's your dude, Kylo Ren. Oh my god, Austin LeMay is gonna enjoy this one. We got Spawn issue 300 with the Spawn one swipe on it, like that's awesome. Oh man, that Jack Kirby image, dude, that's fantastic. Some Moon Knight goodness. The Joker, this wicked Punisher image here. And then we go to the full size. Here we go. With the certificate of authenticity in these right here. The Joker, you're the villain, 27 out of 50. You got that Heath Ledger. Wow. A Star Wars bounty hunter. <laughs> Whoa. Amazing Spider-Man 800 blank. With the uh, ASM 129 homage, Captain America 1 homage. Wow, 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 wow. Hulk 181. The last run, I remember watching him do this one live. He was working on this one live on the uh, the community hangout on Fridays. This was insane watching him create some of these. Now, I'm going to put his information as well in the description of this. Be sure to go follow him. Check him out for this amazing art. He literally burns this art on the paper with a wood burning tool that he's mastered. So we've got two more here. We've got Hulk number one with that Hulk 181 homage that he then homaged again. And then Black Cat number one. You know, risque. Or either she's hungry and fingers are on the list for meals today. So that is it. So all of those are going to start getting put into giveaways uh, when I'm pop up on stuff on people's channels or give it just any chance i get i'll start throwing some back out there on uh, sunday nights live shows for at weeks in those will start getting put back out into the community huge thank you to legal burning and also finally a big announcement i do want to remind everybody next sunday this coming sunday is the ultimate fallout for a live giveaway right here on this channel starting Sunday night at 9 p.m. Eastern, real time. And that's when DJ Lynx and myself will be giving away the CGC 9.4 Ultimate Fallout 4 first print, first appearance of Miles Morales. And it's going to be a huge celebration. We're going to be doing some other stuff, some live giveaways and stuff like that for people that are in the chat hanging out. So be sure to spread the word. It's going to be a good time and appreciate everybody. Leave me a comment in the description or in the comment section let me know what you think of all this cool stuff uh that, that, dude major shout out to legal burning dude thank you so much i'm looking forward to getting this all back out there and a huge thank you to butterball be sure to go give him a follow on instagram i've really appreciated a lot and like i said let him know guys that uh we are legion